Hey guys, this is Mrs. Geis and I am making a video for you to kind of ease your worries about coming back to in-person learning. If you're one of the students that has decided to come back on an A day or a B day, um, I'm going to kind of walk you through what the day is going to look like and, and hopefully we'll have a really smooth first day on Monday. If you're staying remote, don't worry, it's gonna, we're going to continue as we were and we're going to knock this year out. Okay, so here I am standing at the front of the school. Um, if you are a car rider or a walker, you're going to be screened right here at the front of the school. Car riders will have a screening in their car. And when I say screening, I mean they're going to go ahead and take your uh, temperature on your forehead. You probably had this done other places. Then they're going to ask you some questions. Please be truthful and honest when you're answering the questions for everyone's safety. And then they're going to admit you to the school. I believe you're going to get a wristband um, like I'm wearing today as I was screened. All teachers are also screened as we come in to the building. So that's what I mean when I say screening and it's nothing to worry about. Just like I said, be truthful and honest for everyone's safety. All right. So let me go ahead and switch around here. And I'm going to take you right through the school. So once you have had your screening, you will come on in to the main foyer and walk on down the hall to your homeroom. And if you're not used to where the eighth grade wing is, it's the first wing on the left. These first bathrooms here will be closed. We'll be using the bathrooms downstairs, but we'll be going over more of that in just a minute. So you come on down and your teacher, your homeroom will possibly be on this hall unless you have me as your homeroom teacher. Science is downstairs. Okay, but all the seventh grade and I'm sorry, all the eighth grade teachers are on this hall. We have social studies first, then we have math, then we have English language arts at the very end. Okay, if you are a bus rider, you will be getting screened as you come off the bus. Same thing, they're going to take your temperature, they're going to ask you some questions, and then you're going to um, uh, be admitted to the school and you're going to be up coming up the ramp and coming in that entrance there. Okay. See, and there's Miss Brunelli. She's excited to see you back as well. <laughs> awesome. All right, so now let's go downstairs. If you have me for your homeroom, we're right down the stairs here. Going to go down this staircase, unless you're coming in off the bus. And these are the bathrooms that will be open for 7th and 8th graders, but you will not be admitted to the bathroom without a pass, so make sure you go to your homeroom first, okay? And my classroom is just the first one on the right, so here we are, okay? Welcome to our classroom. Here I want to point out we have some guidelines, we have what we call the 10-10 rule for bathrooms. Um, you won't be able to go to the bathroom the first 10 minutes or the last 10 minutes of class. Also, we have some standards that we're going to abide by, like wearing, keeping our masks on. I know it's a pain, but we have to do it. Standing six feet apart, right? Phones away and on silent during class. And then for my class, I expect you to bring a charged Chromebook to class every day, your LearnEd notebook, and a pencil or pen, something to write with. That's it. Okay, so we have seating charts. I've created seating charts, as you can see right here. I will be helping you find your seats. And this is what our classroom looks like. So we've got our smart board here, um, my teacher workstation, and then your student desks. Okay, if you look closely, you will notice that the desks have orange or green dots on them, placed on them. And that helps you to know where to sit um, during class. I think you can see those. Sorry for the, my photography skills are not the greatest. Um, but anyway, we're super excited to have you guys uh, come back to school. It's been a long time. It's been a year since we've had students in the building and teachers are super excited about it. And 
Um, we'll guide you through. Once you've gotten into the building, don't worry, your homeroom teacher will go over everything with you. Um, you'll be eating lunch with your, uh, I believe, third block teacher. We'll also be having our uh, intervention or enrichment during that time, but we'll go through all of that with you. Um, I do have a schedule right here in case you haven't gotten one, but you can see kind of right there. I don't know how well you can see it with the light reflecting on it, but anyway, again, I'll be communicating via email and Canvas to you. So I guess the biggest takeaway from this is don't worry. We're going to be fine. We're super excited to have you back. Um, and we're lucky in this classroom, we do have sinks. We have two sinks in this classroom, so um, you'll be able to wash your hands whenever you need, um, and especially before you eat lunch. So anyway, that's it for today. I appreciate you watching, and I can't wait to see you on Monday. Be safe. Bye-bye.